Tonight, questions still surround the death of an Olathe teenager. Police tell us there are no new developments in the case of Jasmine Mills. The 17-year-old was found dead in the back of a semi-trailer. KCTV 5's Amy Anderson spoke with her family. She joins us live tonight from Kansas City, Kansas. And Amy, that family is heartbroken. It is such a sad story, Brad. Jasmine Mills would have celebrated her 18th birthday in three months. Her family says she loved airplanes and dreamed of one day becoming a pilot. But tonight, investigators are still trying to figure out who dumped her body near this industrial area of Kansas City, Kansas, and her family is suffering. As sad as this is for me, I can't imagine what her mom's going through. Casey Knedlick is Jasmine Mills' godmother. Mills' mother, too grief-stricken to talk, asked her to speak on her behalf. You see these things on the news, but you don't expect it to happen to you. Jasmine went missing Thursday night. She and her 16-year-old sister had recently returned from cleaning out a semi for a friend of theirs, a man who offered the teens money to clean up his truck. He called her again and said, you guys forgot to take the trash out. Like they, And so she went up there. By herself. Investigators have not confirmed whether that man had anything to do with Jasmine's disappearance, but they do say they found her body in the trailer of a semi two days later. We've known him for a couple years, but he I've never been comfortable around him. And as many times I told her not to go up there alone, the one time she did, she came up missing. Tonight, Jasmine's family and closest friends are gathered near Lake Olathe, a place she loved so much. They say they're trying to figure out how to go on without the girl who made them laugh, who cooked for them, and who loved reading to her younger brothers and sisters. They say they'll never understand why this happened. Like, I can't imagine her just laying there by herself, dead next to broken beer bottles and trash like really you're just gonna throw her out in the trash she's a person and there's a lot of people hurting because of this now jasmine's family struggling to pay for her funeral they have set up a fund for people to donate if you'd like to help we've posted a link on our website at kctv5.com you can just click on found it on five in the meantime if you have any information that might help police in their investigation Call the TIPS hotline at 816-474-TIPS. Reporting live tonight in Kansas City, Kansas, Amy Anderson, KCTV5 News. Thanks.